All right, so the last thing that we're gonna do in PowerPoint before we jump over to Outlook for iPad and iPhone is working with the presentation side of things. So to get into the slideshow view, to show your presentation to others, you're gonna go over to this right-hand corner. Um, right now, I have it set up as pre presenter's mode so I can show you all the options. It's either gonna be a play button here or an iPad with a, a computer screen. So go up to that right-hand corner and click on that. This will bring you into the slideshow view. So from here, um, to get to your next slide, simply swipe right to left, and that will bring up your next slide. Also with animations, you do the same thing. Swipe right to left, and it'll bring up those animations if you're using them. And to go back, you simply swipe left to right, and then it'll take you back. So now that we have the basics out of the way, there are a few things on that top taskbar that you can use. The first one is the piece of paper. If you click on that, it's going to bring up your notes screen. This can be extremely helpful when you want to add in talking points. Uh, this can't be seen by your audience, so this is only for your use. You can add notes for individual slides and use them um, throughout your presentation. So we'll go ahead and close that. The next tool is the pen tool. If you click on the pen, um, your audience will be able to see this. You can draw on your slide to highlight certain points. Um, and then from there, the one next to that, the pen with the gear, will change your pen settings. So that'll be the color. Um, you can change it to a thicker marker. You can erase cer certain pen marks, or you can clear the pen markings as a whole. So we can do that now. Um, the next one is the two little windows uh, that will hide your current size that you have up. So if you want to take one off the screen for a second while you're talking, um, that can be useful. And then the last one is expanding it into a full screen mode. Uh, so you can just go ahead and swipe with that. So that is it for the PowerPoint uh, for iPod, iPad and iPhone, excuse me. Now we're going to head on over to Outlook.